Hello. Hi. How you doing? How are you? I'm well, thank you, sir. My name is Deputy Perry. I work for the Gilpin County Sheriff's Department. Okay. The reason I pulled you over today is you don't have a front license plate on your truck or in your vehicle, and also your license plate's not coming back to anything. It's not coming back to anything. No, sir. What do you mean? So, like, whenever I run the plate, it doesn't. Uh, my dispatcher says she can't find anything on file for that plate. Okay. Can I see your driver's license registration proof interest, please? And actually, I'll take that registration back one more time. I'm sorry. That's my fault. So, is that the only reason why you pulled me over? Because of the front plate? Go ahead, ma'am. Yes, sir. Copy, thank you. Yeah, if you could just check on both of those. Copy, thank you. I'll be right back, sir. Alright. What the fuck is the So, here's your driver's license back. Okay. Here's your registration back. Thank you. Um, this is a warning. I'll have you sign it in a minute. Essentially, though, you are wanted right now out of Elbert County. Um, unfortunately, my jail won't let me book you on it. But just know that I will be looking for you and trying to take you to jail if I can. Um, <laughs> so, if I get you to sign right here. You're not meaning to guilt to anything. However... Okay. This is not an admission of guilt by signing this. All it's the same is that you understand you've been warned for the front license plate. Okay. If, uh, I'm going to go put this in the system, so if another officer were to contact you, and at least in Gilpin County, we would know that you've already been warned for it, okay? Okay. That's all that this is saying. I'll go take care of it. Okay. I do appreciate that, sir. You know, just as a side note. Yeah. I'm very supportive of law enforcement. Unfortunately, um, what's happened here in Gilpin County, um... There's quite a few um, criminal complaints pending with um, the judicial system. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, Sheriff Armstrong is also involved with that. But um, you know, so what you your comments that you said were a little bit disturbing. But I understand where, where you're coming from. Mm -hmm. um, I've done nothing wrong. I'm just a loving father. Hey, listen. Every, there's you know three sides to every story. What they say, what he says, and the truth, right? Um, <laughs> Just as far as I'm aware, you're still wanted out of Elbert County. I'm not sure for what, or actually, it's, it's, I think it's for contempt of court and failure to appear. Well, I contacted uh, Sheriff Tim Norton to ask him what was the, uh, if it was actually, if there was a legitimate warrant for my arrest and what was the story. Yes, sir. And um, I never heard back from them. In okay. Fact, I've sent out several, I've sent out several contacts to do my due diligence. Uh-huh. Sheriff Armstrong is well aware of my case. Yeah. And, um... I think it would be improper for uh, for Gilpin County to, to try and incarcerate me at this point, given the fact that there are pending criminal complaints and a number of other things related to this matter. I'm yeah. just telling you. Right, right. And so. And I'm very supportive of law enforcement, but unfortunately, this this matter has really uh, gotten out of out of, out of hand. Yeah. Um, the reason the jail won't take right now on your warrants is I think it's of COVID, even though it's it's kind of long gone. They still are uh, under COVID restrictions, from uh, what I understand. So they're not taken right now. Um, it used to be, like whenever, because I used to work somewhere else before this, um, if I had a warrant out of pretty much anywhere, as long as it wasn't out of state, they would come pick up on it. But it doesn't look like Elbert County wants to play with us. And so, <laughs> what do you mean they don't want to play with you? They, so essentially, like okay. when, somebody, when you book somebody on a warrant, the, if it's from, like let's say it's from Denver PD, right? Denver PD has to say, hey, we'll come pick up on this warrant. Transfer. Right. However far out. Just, um, just so you understand, there was also some recent other, other court hearings that were supposed to take place on January 4th. Uh -huh. I sent letters, actually didn't send, I actually hand-delivered um, in Elbert County and in Douglas County to the chief judge and to the judge Kramer 
explaining the situation and asking them to dis- dismiss the case. Yeah. Because so that could also be why they're not quote unquote playing whatever. Because basically, there's a lot of liability involved. If you guys were to incarcerate me falsely, I mean not you particularly, but if Elbert County were to suggest mm-hmm. that I would need to be incarcerated, that would be you know possibly false arrest and false imprisonment. Yeah. So it's a very serious you know thing. I'm not a criminal. I never have been. I'm just a, I'm a father that's been living here in this county for almost 10 years. Yes, sir. My kids went to Gilpin County School until recently, until they, until this judicial system decided to, to um, do some things that were very, very improper. Anyway, I'll take my my warning and I'll I'll make sure I get a front uh, plate right away. I do appreciate that, sir. Any have any questions for me? Nope. Alrighty, drive safely.